some celebrity Would you be so nice to me? Welcome back to another week of Tabloid Fantasy League. And uh, yes, the TFL seems to be a one-man race right now. Joe Izenga is uh, dominating, but I will give it to you, Katie. You won last week. Yes. You put him in his place a yes, tad, I did. Take tiny that, Joe. bit. 11 right. points for uh, Fun Katie from the Doug and Wolf show uh, yesterday. Of course, she only carved into Joe's huge lead <laughs> by two points. So now he only Thanks leads by 106. Yeah. Uh, Joe with 175 total. Katie now jumps me back into second place. She's at 69. I have 66. And Carrie, she's terrible. Okay. Uh, but uh, you did win. All 11 of your points came from uh, Kim Kardashian last yes. week. Yes. Thank you, Kim K. She was your number one overall pick. Yes. And yet you still passed up Whitney Houston. Otherwise, it could be you doing the bragging over him. I prefer not to talk about it. Can we just get to this week's picks, <laughs> please? Right. This week's picks. Uh, our pinch hitters, uh, we get to keep for one week and one mm -hmm. week alone. We usually pick them based on the news. Sometimes we pick them based on a hunch. I don't know. I don't know their method to their madness. Uh, but uh, in, in this particular case, we go in reverse order of standing. So Carrie will have the number one pick, though she's on vacation. And uh, then it will be myself, Katie, and then finally Joe. Do you have any picks in mind? It's I a have, deep class this week. I have three picks in mind. It's a good group this week. Yeah. I think there's a lot of points out there to be had. All right, uh, Carrie has the first selection. I'll go ahead and make it for her. Uh, not that I'm making it for her, but she left it behind uh, before she headed off to, where did she go for a vacation? Pittsfield, Massachusetts? I Something think that's correct. Very luxurious like mm. that. Where? Uh, <laughs> Pittsfield, Massachusetts. You've never been yeah. there, obviously. Yeah. It's the home of the AA Mets. It's All right, uh, Carrie has uh, decided to take with the number one pick, and God knows why, uh, Jennifer Love Hewitt. Jennifer Love Hewitt has been all around lately. Is she like resurgent with her career? She's well. She's got that new show coming out, The Client. Why is she and getting she's like gigs? A, I don't. I don't know. She's pretty. She's, she plays the Not same really. kind of actress though in everything. She has uh -huh. the same kind of role in everything. Yeah, no matter what she plays. Yeah, it doesn't she could matter. play Hannibal Lecter, and she'd still be like. Yeah, she'd be like, oh hey. Cute and perky. Yeah. All right, that's the number one pick. It's a bad one. Uh, the number two selection I have this week, and boy, it's hard. I'm telling you, there are a lot of people that are not on current rosters in TFL because we can't take somebody from anybody else's roster that are making a lot of headlines. I'm going to go Kardashian magic, Chloe and Kardashian. There is some sort of story behind her and her husband, Lamar Odom, who was cut from his basketball team this week. There has to be some juicy little story behind this, and I'm going to leave it to the tabloid magazines to either uncover it or make something up. I have a feeling she'll be very dramatic this week. Yeah, yeah. So, very Chloe, dramatic. Chloe Kardashian, my selection. You are up next. Who are you taking? You know, I thought about, I was kind of torn between. Two lovers couple, feeling like a fool, yeah, loving them both would be breaking all the rules. Girls, but oh. I decided to go with Janet Jackson. Now, her Nutrisystem ads are coming really? out today, and um, looks there's hippie. a lot of controversy around her after a picture that she looks extremely slim. Yeah. And she's a, I mean, she is a worldwide superstar, so I thought I might be able to hit on all the different magazines okay. with that. All right. You I wasn't even aware of this story. Yeah, I think aware it's, of a, it's a terrible pick. Is it a re I'll <laughs> give you that <laughs> and Gordon Ramsay again from last week. <laughs> yeah, we'll, we'll break the Joe, rules. I beat you last week. <laughs> by That's two. true. She did beat you. Whitney yeah. Houston and she, is done. <laughs> she only trails you by 106, I'll have you know. Nice work. Objects in your rearview mirror are mm -hmm. closer than they appear. Who are you going to go with, Joe? Joe, you got the last pick again, but it doesn't seem to be harming you. No, you've all dropped the ball here. I'm taking Kanye West. <laughs> Kanye West? Yes. Yeah, all right. Decent, decent enough, but I get points when you get points. Well, because he's rumored to be with Kim Kardashian now. Yep. They both... Uh, he was on my list, but Talk I put him six. Well, that's I think the other Kardashian has the juicier story this week. That's yeah. an error. Because she almost had that little uh, on your part. Slip. Yeah, yeah, I think there are a lot of people. Miley Cyrus with the anorexia stuff. Amanda she, Bynes gluten, with the DUI. Lamar Odom. Resistant. Yeah, uh, there are a lot of people you could have gone with, and so there you have it. Those are our picks. If you want to check out our rosters and the scores. You can always go to our uh, ktar.com page. Uh, but there you have it, another week of Tabloid Fantasy League. Please, can I have a 100-point week this week just so I can cut into Joe's lead a little bit? We'll see what happens. Talk to you next week.